Hi guys, it's me Melissa Marie and I'm so excited because I have a great video for you today. So today I'm going to be trying just three, it's only three, beauty hacks. One is going to be for my eyebrows. It's I've seen it all around. I do not remember where exactly like the first time I saw it, but they use got to be. They use the spoolie brush, get your eyebrows up and they use got to be to hold it in place. So I want to try that hack today. Then I saw this next hack on a YouTube channel. I'll put the, the woman who I saw doing it there. Basically, you make a lip plumping mask. So you wear it for like 30 minutes and it's supposed to make you look like you got your lips injected or something like that. So you're just going to need cayenne pepper for that, cinnamon for that. And she used, I think, Carmex, the lip um, Vaseline thing. I'm going to use... Uh, What's this called? Coconut oil. I don't have any Carmex. I do have Blistex. I love Blistex, but I just feel like, let me try to, since I'm already going crazy with the spices, let me just try to do something a little bit more like calm. Um, so I don't even know if it's going to work, but we're going to go ahead and try it. And so let's get started. Oh, and the third hack is um, doing the lashes, but doing them in parts. So like cutting them into four, cutting a regular strip lash into four pieces and then putting each piece on with regular lash glue. And I just wanted to see if it looks different, if it looks better. My little sister told me about that one. I'm not really sure where she found that from, but let's just get right into this video and see how these hacks work today. Okay, so the first hack I'm doing is my eyebrows. So I'm gonna, still I'm gonna use um, this little thing. It's from e.l.f. It's like a little mini brush, but it does have like a little bit of tint in it. It's called wow brow deep brown so i'm just going to use that first and then i'm going to use the got to be i think this will help like tame them a little and since got to be doesn't really have any color see that eyebrow how it's just sticking straight up i don't even know if like the fluffy eyebrows are in anymore i feel like all the styles are changing but either way, look, I like it. So whether it's in, out, we gonna try it today. So I just had these spoolies. I got a whole pack of these on Amazon at one time, but um, I had these two on my dresser. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this one. The got to be, this is a little, I also got this from Amazon. It's a little um, travel size, I guess. So I'm gonna put it on. And I'll definitely come back later to show you how everything held up because I, um, I'm actually gonna do the eyebrow part of this. I mean, the eyelash part of this a little bit later. I mean, obviously it'll be like two seconds, like one second after this when you are watching the video, but it'll time will have passed so we can see how these look later on. Is that good? That's all right. All right, let's go back and show you the other side. Okay, so it looked a little crazy to me, um, but we're gonna just roll with it. Okay. I like this one a little better than this one, but I don't wanna keep messing with it because I don't want it to start um, drying and then flaking or something. So we're just gonna leave that like that. Now we're gonna go ahead and try the little mixture. I'm gonna put it in this glass. Some of this kind of is liquidized and, oh, is that a word? So. It's kind of a lot just for one session, but we're rolling with it. You're rolling with it. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. Um, and the woman who I watched, she did not really measure. So all I know is cayenne pepper got a kick to it. So I ain't gonna put too much more than that. Stop the cap. I don't believe you. Maybe just put a little bit more. Bruh. That escalated quickly. And then we're gonna do the cinnamon. I put a good amount of that in there too. Um, I have this, I got this from Dollar Tree, so I'm just gonna use this. Now that I thought about it, I she probably used the Carmex or the Blistex because 
it probably stayed on your lips a little better because it's thicker. This is very like liquidy. I don't even know if it's gonna stay on my lips because it have to it has to stand for like a half hour. My fault. All right. So that's what it looks like when I'm finished mixing it. And again, her video I should have popped it up on the screen already. Already, so you could go look at it because I'm probably messing this all up. So do not try this at home based on my instructions. I am not an expert. <laughs> You've been warned. I'm kind of nervous. Mm, like my lips well. Dry a little. Okay, here we go. So I'm gonna take the thing, the brush. Just I'm gonna line my lips. I'm not feeling any burning at all. And she started to feel the burning right away. for Because that's really all it's doing. I think it's causing like a bit of a reaction from the pepper and the cinnamon. I'm not feeling anything. Okay, I just added a little bit more cayenne pepper, guys. Bruh. So, I don't feel any burning. It's not that I want to feel burning, but I feel in my mind if it's burning, it's working. I wonder if the if this is like canceling out the burning. <clears throat> That's why you should just follow instructions, you know? Just, just to try a little bit harder, I'm gonna do a little bit more cinnamon. Okay, that's all we're gonna do. I'm not doing it anymore. I still don't feel any burning or tingling or anything. I'm gonna leave it for a half hour and I'll be back. And when I come back, we'll see if it did anything. And we'll also try the eyelash hack. So that'll be back in like... So we're back. I haven't even taken it off yet. I do not know if I see a difference or not. So I'm gonna go ahead and take it off now. Oh, I'm gonna put like try to do a split screen of when I first started right before I put it on so we can see if there's a little bit of a difference or not nope I don't know it was something I wanted to try if I ever try it again I'll probably try it with the Carmex just to see if that works better maybe I'll add a little bit more cayenne a little more cinnamon maybe I need to just watch her tutorial again I don't know but it seemed to work when she did it it did give it like a nice juicy plumpness. I mean, it wasn't no huge change, but it was like a little bit of a poutiness and a plumpness. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and put my Bliss X on now. Bruh. I don't know. You see something, you don't? I don't know. But either way, we're gonna be right back with the lashes next. All right, and I'm back. Did you even know I left? <laughs> I didn't know which lashes I wanted to use because I really don't want to mess them up if I'm going to mess up this experiment. But these were already messed up in my package. You can see there's like a large chunk missing from them right there. So because of that, I'm just going to use these. I'm going to take these here now. This is so cute. It even comes with this. And I did get this from Dollar Tree, so that's cool. And it's already kind of just like missing like that. I'm going to just start there. And then I'll just do, I guess, four of their little sections. All right, I'm gonna trust the process because I'm already nervous. I don't know if you can hear my son's music, so I'm already just going to um, just do the rest of this, like kind of sped up because I'm gonna just try to mute it. Oh my gosh. Look at this glue. You think? I don't think this glue is working. Let me get a di different glue. Okay, so we're gonna use this glue.
so that is the end of the video i did my eyebrows i did my lips i did my eyelashes <laughs> trying beauty hacks and i really hope you guys enjoyed this video i know everything didn't come out perfectly i also know there was a lot of user error in this video but um you know it was just a fun video to do and as always i just want to say thank you so much for watching i truly appreciate it see you in the next video thank you so much for watching